Let's look at another confidence interval example. The Genetics and IVF Institute has studied the XSORT method, which is designed to increase the probability of conceiving a girl. Of the 574 babies born to parents in the study, 91.46% were girls. Find a 90% confidence interval for the percentage of girls born to parents who have children using XSORT. In general, the endpoints of a confidence interval for P would be P hat plus or minus Z star times the square root of P hat, 1 minus P hat, all over N, where Z star can be found in this chart. Okay, since we have a 90% confidence interval in this problem, Z star in this problem will be 1.645. So let's remember that on the next page. Okay, so the endpoints of a 90% confidence interval for P are going to be P hat plus or minus Z star, which in this case is 1.645, uh, times the square root of P hat, 1 minus P hat over N. Sometimes we use Q hat instead of 1 minus P hat. It doesn't matter whether you use Q hat or 1 minus P hat. The, book, the textbook uses Q hat. Both represent the probability of failure. Because if P hat is the probability of success, then 1 minus P hat is the probability of failure. Okay, so here's our 90% confidence interval. You have p hat plus or minus 1.645 times the square root of p hat, 1 minus p hat over n. p hat, again, that's the proportion of, that's the proportion of successes. Well, there was a 91.46% probability of success, so as a decimal, p hat is 0.9146. We've got to express it as a decimal when we use this formula. Plus or minus 1.645 times the square root of 0.9146 times 1, point, 1 minus 9, 0.9146 all over 574. Remember this problem? N equals 574 is the number of trials. Uh, that simplifies to 0.9146 plus or minus 1.645 times 0 0.0117, which is 0.9146 plus or minus 0.0192. So, as decimals, a 90% confidence interval for P would be 0 0.8954 and 0.9338, but if we want as a percentage, then a 90% confidence interval would be 89.54% to 93.38%. So we are 90% sure that the true percentage of girls born to parents uh, in this, you know, parents who use XSORT would be somewhere between 89.54 and 93.38%.